Due to COVID-19, school districts across the country, including Arkansas, are desperate for substitute teachers. In Mayflower, they say, is one of the worst sub shortages they've seen in a long time. Jessica Rank joining us in the studio with more on this. Jessica, what do they say about the year compared to last? Yeah, Bob. Well, substitute shortages are not uncommon, but the past two years, it seems there's been more of an issue getting those fill-ins. They say the reason most of it has to do with COVID. It's the one time during the school day where this classroom sits empty. No students in chairs or writing on the whiteboard. I need my prep time. I need it to get ready for my subjects that I teach. At least once a month this year, that time has been cut short for Heather Malone as she walks down the hall to another class. There's no subs to come fill that spot. Mayflower Public Schools is asking teachers and staff to fill in the gaps as substitute shortages continue. The numbers went down when COVID. Right now, Superintendent Andy Chisholm says they have about 80 subs on their list. But with other school districts in the mix, they're not always picking from double digits. While there may be 80 people on that list, some of them may be in North Little Rock or Conway or Bologna. For a small school district like Mayflower, Chisholm says sometimes subs will go where the money is. It's not in the budget for us to, to, to pay more right now. The district says COVID played a big role in the shortage. More subs are limiting their contacts and getting unemployment benefits. People are making more money at home than working. Until they can fill the empty seats, teachers like Malone will have a full class schedule. But she says she's always happy. We care about each other. To lend a hand. Now, the superintendent says in some cases they're reaching out to family, friends, and even former teachers to apply for those positions. Live in studio, I'm Jessica Rank for KARK 4 News.